Hello everyone, it's Paul from Guitar Gear Connection. On this episode, we're going to be doing a little sound comparison of the Rickenbacker High Gain Factory Pickups versus the Factory Vintage Style Toaster Top Pickups. I just picked up this 2023-21 fret Rickenbacker 360 and I figured this would be the perfect candidate for the testing. So stick around and let's hear some more. I just recently sold my 2005 360 for this newer 2023 360. Rickenbacker made some great enhancements this year and I could not resist scooping one up. Hopefully I'll have a video out soon comparing the two, but for now let's stick to the pickups. So back when I purchased that 2005, I had the toasters put on right away. For me, if not the sound, the toasters just look a hell of a lot better. But I always wondered how much of a sound difference there really was between the two. When I sold my 2005, I swapped the high gains back on and kept the toasters for the 2023. At the end of the video is a sped up video of me changing out the pickups. The hardest part to the whole job was getting the dang rubber grommets to seat correctly between the body and the pickup. Before I swapped the pickups, I whipped out the voltmeter and measured what the ohm output was. The high gains that came out of the 2023 were reading 11.99 for the neck pickup and 12.15 for the bridge pickup. Those toasters that I bought brand new in 2005 right from Rickenbacker read 7.36 for the bridge pickup and 7.28 for the neck. Now let's hear what they sound like through my 1999 Korg AC30 with the two blue Celestian speakers, treble turned all the way up, bass halfway through the Brilliant channel.
Well, that concludes this episode. Please like and subscribe to this YouTube channel. That's what keeps me going making these videos. As well as check out my Instagram. I post up a ton of cool pictures and videos there as well. Thanks again, everybody. I'll see you on the next video.